Hey guys, it's Erica. I'm just here to share a few things with you. I have a couple of hauls and my Simon Says Stamp Kit um, for this month. So I want to start off by sharing you my Simon Says Stamp Kit. I've had it for probably a week now. I just haven't had time to make a video. I had a really busy weekend. So, <clears throat> yeah my last week at my store. I actually have today off because I'm supposed to work on Saturday, but I don't think I'm going to work on Saturday. I'm just going to try to make up the hours during the week. Um, I might go in a little later just for a few hours, but um, yeah, it's pretty sad. Yesterday was like my last staff meeting with, you know, my peers and my managers. Everyone tried to get all emotional, but I was like, please don't get emotional. Um, so I try to make it fun and lighthearted, but yeah, next week I start my new job and I'm actually in training for six weeks and I'm going to be traveling to different stores, um, for the next six weeks. And then after that, I have a week of training in Atlanta. So I'm going to be busy for the next like seven weeks. So it'll be cool though. Um, anyways, here is my Simon Says Stamp Kit. Here is the inspiration sheet. This, um, this month was kind of cool because it's all, like, boy-themed. Um, even the stamp set is, like, a little boy-themed. Or, you know, just boy-themed, which is really cool. The papers are really cute. Um, so there's the inspiration sheet. And so... The stamp set is called All Boy, and it is super cute. Sorry for the little bit of glare. I'm trying to get some light, natural light in here. Um, so you got the stars and the dots. Thanks. If you play hard, All Boy, the sneakers, the remote control, some stars. It says, boy, and now, noise with dirt on it. That's really funny. It says, hey, dude, you're a winner. And then just um, some dots here that you can use, like, as a border or whatever. So, I think that one, that stamp set is really cute. And I don't have any, like, boy kind of themed stamps. So, um, really happy with this stamp set. And then you also get the... Um, stars and dots stencil I don't know if you can see that it's got the stars and the dots so I thought that was pretty cool and it's a bigger stencil it doesn't say the size but it is <clears throat> like a six and a half you know like a six and a half it's like a three like three inch by like six and a half inch um, stencil so that's pretty you know a bigger stencil they're they usually give like small stencils I don't know if I can find one really quick I keep all my stencils right here on my desk together yeah well I guess they've given like they've given this stencil which is like bigger like the same size but they normally give like small stencils so anyways so that stencil was really cool. Let me put all this back. Okay. And the pattern paper is from Fancy Pants. And it's called, it's the Be Different Collection. So here are the papers. You get like half of the pad. Um, so this one's got monsters. And it says monsters rule. This one's got the stars. I really like the colors. Um some wonky stripes, some plaid, some diagonal stripes, chevrons, this is like orange on a yellow paper, polka dots, black and green polka dots, and I don't know if you can tell, this does have a pattern, it's like red and white, or red and yellow, there we go, pattern, this has a whole bunch of words, like kind of frame that's a cool pattern the houndstooth more plaid multicolor polka dot 
It's that same weird pattern. In like the borders. So I like this paper pad. It's really cute. And then we got some um, chick, chicken nitty. I don't know. Chicken. I don't know how to pronounce it. Chicken nitty. Um, enamel hearts. I've never heard of that. Chicken nitty crafts. I'm not sure. But it's got like. Uh, like a dark aqua, like a a lighter aqua, um, like a minty, like soft aqua and yellow. And they're all enamel hearts. And then we also got, which I thought was really cool, was the Tim Holtz. Uh, they gave us the mini blending tool and a little mini um, distress ink. So we got the Peacock Feathers Distress Ink, the little mini one. And then the blending tool with two, um, oh, I didn't mean to take that off. Sorry, guys. What? There we go. Two of the little foam circles. So I thought that was really cool that they would give us this. So we got that. And then we got the cardstocks to match. So we got a, a, these are all Simon Says Stamp cardstocks. They're really thick. We got the red. I think this is called Schoolhouse Red. We got a blue, dark navy blue. We got kind of like this olive kind of olive color. And the Nina Desert Storm. And then a white. So that was the kit for this month. Um, overall, I'm pretty happy with it. I like the stamp set and everything. So not too bad. All right, I went to Michael's this past week to um, look for something for a friend and I picked up some things for myself. Um, the only thing that I <clears throat> had originally picked up for myself was this um, color shine in the color citron. Let me get it out of here. There's, it's like stuck. Okay. Um, I really wanted this color because it's like a really bright green. It's a really pretty, and I used my 40% um, off coupon on this, so it uh, came out to be. $3.59 um, so that's and I had sprayed it like that's what it looks like it's a really really super bright so that's what I had originally per purchased that I just picked up for myself um, and I got you know what I was looking for for my friend but then I had noticed like this is where all the Heidi Swap stuff is down the the stamp aisle like they have gotten some new Heidi Swap stuff like the stencils and the cards and stuff um, and they were filling that area and that's where this color shine was with the rest of the color shines but I had noticed that they had a little end cap not too far away where they had some more color shines and the stamp pads and just some more stuff that wasn't with the rest of the things that was down the stamp aisle so I just like picked up a couple of things and I took it to the cashier and I was like you know I just wanted to see how much this stuff was because it wasn't marked and it wasn't at the in the same place as the other Heidi Swap stuff so she checked the prices for me and everything was like on clearance but it was on clearance but not on clearance she said just said it rang up on sale because I asked her is is it on clearance and she was like no it just rang up on sale so I went ahead and I purchased these two other co uh, color shines I got it in the blush and in the coral and these were on sale for two dollars and 39 cents and I sprayed them and this is the blush and that's the coral 
And then I also um, got this package of embellishments. They're the ephemera. That's the ones that you can spray. And um, here's what it has in there. And this has 90 pieces, and this was $1.59. And then I went back and I got some more stuff from the end cap to see how much it was. And um, I ended up just purchasing these two stamp pads, um, the Heidi Swap ink pads. I got it in the coral and in the mustard color. And these ring up $2.39. Um, and this is, I stamped them out. Like this is the, the coral. And that's the mustard color. So pretty cool. So that's what I got at Michael's. So I'm like all color shined out. I have like so many color shines now. I think I have 13 colors. Um... And there wasn't any more color shines that I didn't have that was on clearance or whatever. I don't even think that there is any colors that I want anymore. But I think I'm going to go back to see if they still have the stamp pads on clearance because why not? Alright. Sorry, I'm like all over the place here. So I um, placed an order with Joann's last week because the um, shipping was free. I just got a few things. I wanted to finish off my distress marker collection and they were on sale for two dollars and seven cents each. So I thought that I got all of them but I'm still missing three colors so I'm kind of upset about that. But I got the pine needles. I got the frayed burlap. Milled Lavender, Dried Marigold, Mustard Seed, Faded Jeans, Scattered Straw, Aged Mahogany, and Chip Sapphire. So I got all of those. My little container here is like getting kind of full. So all I'm missing is peeled paint, weathered wood, and Victorian velvet. And the picket fence, but that's just white, so I'm not going to get that. So I'm missing those three colors, and the weathered wood and peeled paint. Um, Joann's does not carry those colors online. I don't know why, so I'm going to have to buy those from another place. So, whatever. So I need three more colors to complete my set and I'll be done and then I also only purchased two other things I got the Tim Holtz uh, watercolor cardstock and this it comes in a two size four and a quarter by five and a half so I thought that was pretty cool and this was like 40% off and then I also got the Heidi Swap 12 by 12 stencil. It's like the the sun rays or whatever. I thought this would be pretty cool to make like my own background on my layouts. And this was on sale too for like 40% off. And that's all I got at Joann's. Um, so anyway, thank you guys for watching. I do have another video coming up. I made a layout, but I did it for a challenge. So um, I will be uploading that video very soon. Um, thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.